n molecule n molecule each of mass m by 2 of gas a and 2n molecule each of mass m of gas b are contained in the same vessel maintained at same temperature T is constant. The means where the velocity of B type is denoted by B square. Mean square velocity of B is written as and the mean square velocity of the x component x component is given as is W square. And what is W square upon B What is same? Temperature. Whenever temperature same, that means this quantity is same. Average kinetic energy of A equals to average kinetic energy of B. X component of A is given and total of B is given. Here only X component is given. Here full is given. The temperature is same, that means X component, Y component, Z component will be same. So if A, uh, magnitude of A is AX square plus AY square plus AZ square. So A square will become AX square plus AY square plus AZ square. But if AX, AY, AZ are same to same, then I can say A square equals to 3 times AX square. So X component square, I will take as A square by 3. Or total is 3 times that X square. You know, this part followed first. X component given as W square. But all the components are same because temperature is same. Therefore, total mean square is nothing but 3 times W square for B. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Average kinetic energy is half. Mass of A is N by 2 into C square. This is half. Mass is N into C D square. Both side half cancel, n cancel, so this is half, total of CA will become 3 times W square and PD is B square. We want ratio of B square upon W square, W square upon B square, that will become 2 by Important is this. X component is given as W square, so total will become 3 times W.
dan so. Imperfect gases having mass of m1, m2 at temperature T1, T2. Masses m1, m2 temperature T1 are mixed without loss of internal kinetic energy. The final temperature is T of the mixture is warm. Final temperature of the mixture is warm. Final temperature of the mixture is Mass M1, mass M2, temperature T1, temperature T2 are mixed together. What is the temperature of mixture if there is no loss in kinetic energy? That is Pv equals to NRT. Yes. Since no loss in kinetic energy, so it obeys Boyle's law. Temperature is constant. That means initial and final. No loss in kinetic energy. Therefore, temperature is maintained. Huh? That is, I can say P E equals to P one E one plus P two V two. That means first pressure volume, second pressure volume combined together, it gives same P V because temperature is constant. N R T will be N one P one. Plus N two T two N R T one N R T two. So well, R R R I can cancel. So N T is N one T one plus N two T two. Therefore T equals to N one T one plus N two T two upon N. So same as N1 T1 plus N2 T2, N is total number of moles N1 N2. Now N1 you can write given weight upon molecular weight T1 plus given weight upon molecular weight T2 upon given weight by molecular weight given weight by molecular. This is the required answer for the question. Is option B. That notation there is small m and capital M को उल्टा कर दो। No loss in kinetic energy means obeys Boyle's law.
Danza. यूनिवर्सल गैस कॉन्स्टेंट दैट इज इमिटेड बाय आर इज एट पॉइंट थ्री जूल पर मोल कैलरी एंड द अवगड्रो नंबर एन ए इज सिक्स इनटू टेन रेस टू ट्वेंटी then mean kinetic energy of oxygen molecule at temperature of 327 degree celsius that is 327 plus 273 it can be calvin will be out average kinetic energy of a molecule is equals to q by R e upon Avogadro number. So three by two into eight point three into six hundred upon six into ten raised to twenty. Two into three is nine into eight point three upon six into ten raised to minus twenty one. Into three nine, three into three six, three to the nine, three to the twenty four, upon two into ten raised to minus twenty. One two point four five into ten raised to minus twenty one. Four point four five into ten raised to. That is option C. One two four five into ten raised to minus twenty.
danza. Average magnitude of linear momentum in a sample of mass at zero. Linear momentum and denoted by T. Linear momentum at temperature of zero degrees Celsius, that is 270 Kelvin. It's nearly how much? If mass of medium is 16 to 10 raised to minus 27 kg and Boltzmann constant is 1.38 into 10 raised to minus 23 kg. It's for 10 Momentum equals to mass into velocity t, which is root of root fifty upon m. M squared root fifty upon m. Mass is six into ten raised to minus twenty seven into t. T is one point two into ten raised to minus twenty two. to minus 24. 25 into 7 is 125. Carry 7. 17. So to 15, 67.5 into 10 is to minus 24. Answer will be close to 8 area 64. So it will be close to 8. Yes. Answer will be close to eight. Nearly they want eight into ten base to minus.
danza. Universal gas on skin. Mean kinetic energy of 32 gram of oxygen. So kinetic energy of 32 gram of oxygen. That is indirectly for molecular vapor. 2 by 2 R2. Two gram is nothing but one mole. One mole is three by two R T. So this three by two into R eight point. We can think thirty two gram of oxygen is actually one mole of oxygen. For one mole, formula is three by two R T. Into temperature is minus seventy three. The temperature minus 73 equals to minus 73 plus 73 equals to 200. 200. This is a 9, 3, 8, 24 into 100 equals to 3490. Yes, a mole of gas receives an amount of heat Q and does work W. The increase in temperature is on. Change in temperature, delta T0. When work is done, that means heat supplied is at constant pressure. Because if volume is constant, then work done will be zero. So since work is done, therefore heat is supplied at constant pressure. Heat supplied at constant pressure, Q is used to increase internal energy and to perform work. We want increase in internal energy. Yes, sir. Heat supplied at constant pressure is used to increase internal energy and to perform work. This is nothing but PVDT. This is work done. So Q minus W is PVDT. This is called specific heat at constant volume. 
u minus w upon c v is u. You all know definition of heat supplied at constant volume and constant pressure because I did explain in the last class. Specific heat for that? Specific heat at constant pressure, constant volume. Hello. 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 Yes, sir. You know these terms? Heat capacity and heat supplied at constant pressure, constant volume. का meaning थोड़ा बहुत. Chemistry हुआ क्या नहीं अभी तक thermodynamics? Yes. हाँ हुआ है. अगर हुआ रहेगा तो ये मालूम है ना first law of thermodynamics. Heat supplied is used to increase internal energy and to perform work. Yes, sir. So based on that, if you don't know, then I have to explain all. If not, then at least I can complete and after completion, next lecture I can start with thermodynamics. This basics you are knowing, na? Yes, sir. Okay, please copy then. See any doubt? Don't hesitate. If you have doubt, then there is no problem. I have to explain. If you don't have doubt, then I can move ahead. Detail will see in thermodynamics. Thirty-six. If R is universal gas constant, then amount of heat needed to raise the temperature of two mole of gas, monatomic gas, from temperature two seventy-three to three seventy-three. That means change in temperature is 100 Kelvin. Gas is monatomic. Then no work is done. Work done zero. Therefore, heat is supplied at constant volume. It is supplied at constant volume. Now, for monoatomic gas, CV is three by two R. This you have to remember. How it came three by two R? I will explain in thermodynamics. So now, heat supplied DQ is n times CV dT. N is two. Cv is three by two R, dT is hundred, so this equals to three hundred R. Three hundred R option C.
done so. For hydrogen gas, Cp is 3400 calories per kg Kelvin. And Cv is 2400 calories per kg Kelvin. R is 8300 joule per kilo mole Kelvin. Then value of JJ is called mechanical equivalent of heat. That means when you have to convert joule to heat, we have to divide by J. Molecular weight is 2. By Mayer's relation, Cp minus Cv is R divided by j because units are not same when work is converted into heat or heat into work then work is j into h j is called mechanical equivalent so work is in joule heat is in kilocalorie or calorie becomes j this is called mechanical equivalent of heat so joule if I divide by J, I get answer in calories or kilocalories. That is what I have done. So 3400 minus 2400 is 8300 upon J. This is 1000 equals to 8300 upon J. J is then 8300 upon 1000. Two zeros cancel. Molecular weight is also given, so divide by M. M is 2. two, two. This will become 2 into 4, 1.5 upon 10. Therefore, 4.15. 4.15 Here only chance of mistake student will write directly as 4.18 without calculation assuming that you have done it yeah, J is nothing but 4.18 joules per calorie. Two ninety four joule of heat energy is received. It is received to raise the temperature of two mole of gas from 30 to 35. So change in temperature is 5. Difference whether it's Celsius, Kelvin, it will be same. At constant pressure, the specific heat capacity at constant pressure is how much? If R is 8.4 Joule per mole Kelvin. Heat supplied at constant pressure is given by N C P D T. C P means heat supplied to increase temperature of unit mole by one degree Celsius or one Kelvin. So C P is for one mole, N C P is for N mole for temperature D T is total heat. So 294 equals to 2 into C P into D T is 5. Therefore C P will become 
माइनस सी वी आर इज गिवन एट पॉइंट फोर देर फोर सी वी इज ट्वेंटी नाइन पॉइंट फोर माइनस एट पॉइंट फोर दैट इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी वन नाउ हिट सप्लाइड एट कॉन्स्टेंट वॉल्यूम विल बी एन सी वी डी टी बिकॉज एवरीथिंग इज सेम सो इट इज टू इन टू सी वी ट्वेंटी वन डी टी फाइव इक्वल्स टू टू हंड्रेड एंड टेन जूल्स ऑप्शन ए Now complete thirty-eight and Answer. Both completed. Thirty-eight, thirteen, and both. Yes, sir. Okay. Forty-eight. The following statement: A set of values gives CV and CP of a gas reported by different student. The unit is in calorie. See, first remember CP minus CV is equal to R in calories per gram mole. In calories per gram mole Kelvin, R is two. Also, CP is greater than CV, and CP minus CV is R. Now we'll check in which case CP is greater and difference is two. In first case, CV is three, CP is five. Therefore, CP minus CV is two. This is the right answer. Done. Shall I clear it again? Yes, sir. The amount of heat required to raise the temperature of amount of heat required to raise the temperature of one gram mole of monoatomic gas. monatomic gas by 1 kelvin okay for at constant volume for mono 
एटॉमिक गैस सी वी इज थ्री बाई टू आर सो हीट सप्लाइड इज एन सी वी डी टी फॉर वन मोल ऑफ गैस सी वी इज थ्री बाई टू आर फॉर वन कैलवी सो इट बिकम्स वन पॉइंट फाइव आर वन पॉइंट फाइव आर इज ऑप्शन ए सब नंबर फोर्टी टू dimension of specific heat okay dimension of specific heat definition bata do now what is specific heat anybody knows the definition the amount of heat required to raise the temperature of unit mass of substance by 1 degree celsius or 1 kelvin is called as specific heat so total heat required is mass into specific heat into change in temperature s is for unit mass so for total mass it will be m into s change in temperature delta t then it will be ms into delta t or delta theta anything so specific heat will be q into mass into change in temperature therefore its dimension will be dimension of heat heat is energy so m1 l2 t minus 2 upon mass m1 this is k1 so m0 l2 t minus 2 k minus 1 m0 l2 t minus 2 k minus 1 सर ऐसा कोई ऑप्शन नहीं है वी डू टेल टेल द सर के दी अगले आई विल नो यू यू आर यू जस्ट गिव मी मैसेज केमिस्ट्री सर इज केप्ट द लेक्चर ना सो बट डिड यू टेल द सर के आई हैव केप्ट द लेक्चर सो दे यू टोल्ड दैट मिस दैट लेक्चर हु सेड आई डिड टू मोर एस्टरडे ओनली आई टोल्ड 11 टू 12 व्हाट यू आर सेइंग मैन I didn't told time. Eleven to twelve, I told you. I asked you, are you comfortable? Eleven to twelve, you said yes. Now you are telling I didn't told the time. How sir will know, na? Unless until you say extra lecture, like nobody knows, na? But you are telling I didn't told only. This is not good, na? 
uh, informs us because how he knows now because see nobody knows extra timing regular timing we all know extra timing we ask the student and then we keep so just uh, tell the sir i think he will like this hello 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 yes sir completed yes sir आज के लिए फिर इतने ही करता हूं बिकॉज फिर स्पेसिफिक हिट थोड़ा समझा के देन आई एम डूइंग फॉर अदर सम्स दिस फर्स्ट पार्ट क्लियर स्पेसिफिक हिट वाला यस सर सो दैट्स ऑल फॉर टुडे नेक्स्ट वी विल सी व्हाट इज सीपी सीवी मेयर्स रिलेशन देन डिग्री ऑफ फ्रीडम एप्लीकेशन ऑफ डिग्री ऑफ फ्रीडम इन द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर देन डू रिमेनिंग सम एंड देन थर्मोडायनेमिक्स सिनोप्सिस आफ्टर